Hello and good morning. I have something super exciting to share today. I have a newly order, which is a clothing subscription service that um, lets you borrow clothes from the brands Anthropology, Free People, Urban Outfitters, Mod Cloth. There's a couple other big stores there, but um, yeah, you can borrow the clothing up to six pieces for $88 a month. You borrow it for a month, you wear it. If you wanna buy it, you can get some really good deep discounts. So I'm gonna show you exactly the discounts that I could get on um, buying these items. Cause some of it's like, whoa, whoa. So <laughs> let's dive in. I'll show you my first newly box. So here is the packaging that the order arrives in. It comes by UPS, up here is the address label, and then they just zip it closed. So it's actually interesting. There's no zip tie or anything. You just completely unzip it and there are your clothing. Uh, they give you a return label up there, UPS return label. And then you've got all the items that you chose online. It's all kind of rolled up inside here. So I'm gonna go through each item and show them to you. We've got this pink silk midi dress. We've got a red top here. It's kind of sheer on the outside and has a camisole on the inside. Perfect for Valentine's Day. And I'm gonna, I am gonna try all of this on, but I'm just doing a little unboxing with you. And then this black dress, this black dress, a maxi dress, all lacy and strappy up top. And I've wanted to try this on for a while, actually. I've heard really good things about that dress and how pretty it is. This other, like, pleated dress with flowers and roses. Kind of interesting rope detail on it. Just a big, long dress. You can't really see the pleating, but I'm pretty sure it's there. And I do like that little rope on the belt. Gotta try that on. We've got these pink corduroy, I think they're high-rise corduroy boot cut pants by Pilcrow. <laughs> nice pink. It feels very soft. And then the last item, which I have been absolutely dying to get, dying for this, is this big sequin duster. Let me show you. Shazam! <laughs> Can you believe it? It's just beautiful and amazing, crazy, so in love. <laughs> That's the item I've been like really looking forward to trying. So there we go, there's the items and I'm gonna go try everything it's on. The Free People Duster, I think it's called Light Is Coming and it's silver. This is like a silver, sil honestly it's kind of like a silvery gold color. Um, I love the like trim along it. It's really pretty. Um, online, people wear it with all kinds of different things. I would probably wear it with something very simple, similar to this, because the glitter just has so much going on. Do you know what I mean? It's got so much personality. It's got the sleeves. Um, there's a little bit of like a sheer mesh showing at the bottom. Um, it makes a little bit of noise when you move. <laughs> Just that sheer lining on the inside as well. The entire back of it is, again, uh, just totally glittered out. Um, I think it's really fun and it'd be cool, like, you know, we're in weird times right now with this COVID stuff, so why not wear something kind of wild and crazy while you go walk the dog <laughs> or go get coffee or something? You know, where else are you gonna wear it? So anyways, this is like my favorite item so far. Um, from the order. Really excited to get this. Moving right along to dresses, although this might not be the right time of the year to wear dresses because <laughs> we actually have cold weather here. Um, I've got this long pleated dress. I actually really liked it more than I had expected. Um, I think it's just so pretty. I like the little braided belt. I like the pattern on it. I like the flowiness right it's flowy it's pretty the only downside is you have to wear like a strapless bra if you don't want to have your bra strap showing and it's also a little bit tricky to put on because there's all these um all these straps all over the place and when you put it on like i was putting my arm through the wrong hole and didn't know what the heck i was doing <laughs> so you can't really tell but at the back there are some straps that you use to um tighten the neckline so that it's not all loosey-goosey um so you, you have to like tighten it so it stays up <laughs> 
but I just I just think it's really pretty and I'm happy with it um and this was a last minute addition I added it at the last minute um let me show you yeah you can just see the the way it flows and it's pretty it's comfortable you could eat a whole burrito and nobody would know because you're comfy cozy and you're covered up which I love I like clothing that fits after you eat a big meal because I like to eat so <laughs> yeah it looks so pretty along the side almost like those like Grecian type of dresses do you know what I mean like with the flow and stuff so I, I like that pleating I dig it I think it's really pretty so yeah I'm pretty happy with this dress here. is the free people Adela dress. I'll, I'll include the name. Don't worry, but it's a long dress has some little ruffles at the bottom um, The best part of the dress is really the detail up top along the chest area And it also has some strap and strappiness at the back. So I'll try to show you the back <laughs> This is another dress where um, You I'm I have to still wear a strapless bra unless you have like something really cute and pretty and lacy that could show. Maybe you have something cute that won't look like ugly on the straps and stuff. Um, it's a little bit chesty for me. <laughs> this would be perfect for wearing like a date night. Um, I was thinking actually when Andy and I went to Ventura and we went on a little trip to Ventura and we walk near the beach at sunset. It was beautiful. This would be like an amazing dress for that type of occasion. Or really, I mean, you could wear it at so many of the beachy towns here, like downtown Santa Barbara. You're going for an afternoon, hanging out at the beach or going out to dinner or something. So I think you could wear this a lot here by the coast. Um, yeah, definitely not a work dress. <laughs> not for work, <laughs> not work appropriate. <laughs> And it's long and flowy. Um, it still has all that see-through stuff along the side. Like you can see a lot of a lot of skin here. <laughs> lots and lots of skin. And they have it in a few different colors. Um, I went with black. I thought it'd be kind of slimming. Um, they've also got red. I don't know. But if you go to the Free People website, they have it like in the long, like this. They have it in like a short little one. Um, I think it's really an easy dress for a lot of people to wear. This silk midi dress looks so beautiful on so many skinny little gals on Instagram, but I, uh, you can't tell, but I can't fit into it. I can't zip it at all along the back. <laughs> so, um, I can't wear this out. Boo hoo. It looks so cute though. It really bummed me out. Like it's got this cute little thingy up front, tassels. It comes in and then it goes and flares out. I like that kind of A-line shape, little buttons and stuff. But I don't know if I want to show you the back, but that's as far as I'll show you. It does not zip up. And this is a size extra large. That is just wild to me that I can't fit into that. Because normally I can be in a large or extra large. But with this, just no. Just not zipping it. Not happening. And it has pockets. I know. Wouldn't that be perfect? Go wear some cute little sandals, go do a little beach day. <sighs> I know, it looks weird. Um, so this uh, red blouse it has a kind of high ruffle neck. You can see a little ruffle neck there. A button at the back. Big old poofy sleeves. I like the poofy sleeves. Camisole underneath. And you could really dress it up or down. Like you could just wear it with jeans and I don't know something real easy but I decided to try to dress it up as if almost like kind of a nice date night or like you're going into work hmm <laughs> it's been a while huh it's been a while since I've gone to work anyways um so I've just got it with like this black pencil skirt and heels it's all right I feel like um if I were to wear it with this I'd want it to be a little bit more tucked in a little bit more like this type Maybe, yeah, more form-fitting instead of loosey-goosey. Well, I'm not really sure. Maybe it's the neckline. Just something about this doesn't feel right to me. Um, the way that I just styled it right now, it just it doesn't sit well. For my so. last item, I've got some pants. I um, Honestly, I'm not someone who like really gets into fun pants or any type of thing like that because... I like to not pay attention to that area. I prefer to like hide my legs and stomach if possible, just like hide it all. So 
wearing this type of pant is a little bit weird for me and I kind of don't think I'm going to wear it out. <laughs> uh, this is the high rise, I think, boot cut corduroy pants. I got them in pink. As you can see, they've got baby buttons here. They have like a half zip, a couple buttons, some back pockets there. I wasn't sure what size to get, so this is a 16W. Um, it's a little bit loosey. I don't really love the way it fits, like how it's got like kind of loose fabric. <laughs> Not, um, these pants are not my favorite thing from the box, but I'm glad I still tried them anyways. I'd like to give you an overview of my experience with Newly and my like pros and cons list to it. Um, it's mostly pros. I like more than I dislike. Um, <laughs> it's really great that you can try on clothing, t um, from all these different brands, including Anthropology, which I'm a big fan of. I tried some stuff from Free People, which I've never tried before. I like that you can, uh, try on items for one time wear. Um, I think it'd be very useful if you have a special occasion to go to. They do have some fancy dresses. If you're going on a trip, um, you have some type of special occasion where you might not wear something a whole lot or seasonal attire. Like they have these, uh, cute wintery coats and stuff that that, you know, maybe you don't want to keep it in your closet all year. You just want to borrow it, wear it a few times, that's it. So I think that's amazing. Um, I like that you can see reviews and pictures from other users. Um, you can also see some other users will um, include their height and weight and what size they normally wear and what size they got in that particular item. So I can look for other people who are similar to me and see what they wore and what worked for them. Um, I really love the discount they have. I'll show you a screenshot because if you buy some of these clothes, you can sometimes get a steep discount. And I think that's amazing. Like if you fall in love with something, you can get a good price on it. So, so I've got information about the discounts that you can get on each item. The uh, Emmeline pleated midi dress, normal retails 180. You can buy it, you can buy this one for 56% off at 79.19. The Sienna Mock Neck Blouse is normally retail for $98. You can buy it for $60.73, which is 38% off. The Julia Silk Midi Dress that does not fit. Um, I only got it in petite because I didn't have a normal XL. Um, normally retails for $228. You can buy it for $109.44 at 52% off. The Pilcro High Rise Bootcut Corduroy Jeans. Normally retail for $120. You can buy them for $84, which is 30% off. The Adela Maxi Slip is normally $128. You can buy it for $62.72, which is 51% off. And the most amazing discount is the Free Pupil Light is Coming Duster, which is normally $298. That's expensive. You can buy it for $74.50, which is 75% off. I got it in a size small because they did not have anything larger than that. <laughs> So these are some of those great deals that you can get if you decide to buy something from your newly bought. I really like that. Um, another good thing is how they figure out the timing and flexibility with their subscription service. So um, when you place your order, they ship it out to you. Um, they did three day UPS shipping. For me, it took three days because they shipped from, I think, Pennsylvania and I'm in California. So it took a couple days. Um, once you get your items, you can basically kind of have a lot of flexibility in terms of when you return it. They recommend returning items two days before your next subscri subscription date. Um, so that once UPS scans the item and it's showing that it's in transit back, your next box is unlocked and then you can prepare to figure out what you want in your next order. Um, however, if you want to turn stuff in early, you can do an early unlock where they move up your subscription date and you get a new box earlier. If you kind of really like these items or you're out of town, you can wait and send them in late. Um, so you don't have to return it by that particular billing or subscription date. Um, the only thing is you have to wait till UPS scans it and it shows it's back in transit for your box to unlock. So they don't really have these strict, strict timelines. Um, so if you like that flexibility with the timing, I think that would work well for you. Um, what I did not like is sometimes the availability of different sizes because they don't have everything available at all times in every size, which makes sense. 
however um, that sometimes means you know you can't get something this month because they don't have it in your size so you add it to your closet which is kind of like a wish list feature um, and you can stock it and wait and wait and wait and see if it comes in your stock excuse me in stock in your size later on when you're eligible for your next box so that kind of sinks um, the other issue I had is just inconsistent inconsistency with sizing across brands that's not necessarily a newly issue that's just a brand issue uh, like the pink dress that was an extra large that I couldn't zip up that's frustrating um, their pricing is kind of okay ish I found it a little pricey but that's because I've never done this before maybe I don't know maybe their pricing is normal it's $88 per month to borrow six pieces um, one note though is that if you're brand new and you sign up you should use someone's referral code to get $10 off that's what I did um, so I got $10 off the cost of the first month um, so I'll try to include if I have a referral code, I'll try to include it in the description box below. Um, no pressure to use it. Use whatever code you want. Just if you're new, try to find somebody's code so you can save $10. Um, yeah. I like that you can pause it as well. So now I'm kind of going back to the pros list. I like that you can pause it because there's months when I'm probably not going to borrow anything. You know, we're working remote. We're not traveling or going anywhere. <laughs> This isn't really the ideal time to be borrowing work attire. Um, I mostly went for it because it's fun. It makes me happy. And sometimes that's something we sorely need during these times, uh, during COVID. Um, you want something that makes you happy, that gives you something to look forward to in the mail, where you can put outfits together and go wear cute stuff, even if you're just walking the dog, getting coffee, going grocery shopping. So you'll see me wearing my glitter duster to walk slinky around the neighborhood. <laughs> Anyways, overall, a uh, positive experience, and I'd love to hear what you think. And if you get items, what do you get? What do you recommend? So have fun if you do it, and um, thank you for watching. Bye-bye.